What is up there guys and welcome back to a brand new episode of The Evolve. How you guys doing on today? You know what? I'm doing all right. I'm doing all right. You know, today it kind of marks, it's, it's, it's a sad day. It's a sad day because we're coming to the end of the year and as of today, I have ran out of all our R's. Because, because on today, today we're, we're going to be given one, one of these, these people who, that you're not going to guess who said this. One of these people said that when Snoop Dogg sees Eminem that he is going to punch him in the face because of his diss track. Snoop Dogg is going to punch him in the face when he sees him. Um, I said that some of you all were not going to guess who said this, but apparently somehow you guys knew. You all knew exactly who said this. 90% of you all guessed right. And quite frankly, I don't know how you guys guessed. I, 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 because any one of these people could have said this. But you all knew right off the bat. So that's what we're talking about on today. This We're talking about, and I'm going to show you all the clip. Um, this person, he talks about how Snoop Dogg it will punch Eminem in the face when he sees him, among other things. So, uh, let's just get right into this. Alright, so in this first clip, before I reveal who actually said this, in the first clip, what you're going to see, this person is talking about, <laughs> he talks about M's age, and that M is too old to be talking about murdering somebody, to be putting out um, albums and, and albums entitled Murdered uh, by Music or Murdering Anyone because he's not about that life. He, it was so weird that this particular person would talk about somebody's age. It was really weird. <laughs> so um, uh, let's, let me just play the clip. So Bazzino, as you guys seen in this clip, he talked about how Elm is old and um, people in the chat, he had some Eminem members in the chat and he was like, hey, and mind you all, this went on for 45 minutes. He just talked about how he didn't want some shady and Eminem fans in his chat for 45 minutes. So yeah, that's where our first R we're giving him. If you don't know what an R means, we used to give out L's on this channel, but Joe Budden back in like 2018 with the whole I've been better than M, that whole year, that was Joe Budden's, we were constantly giving out L's. So we start giving out R's, which stands for ridiculous or rest in peace or retire. It could mean anything depending on the case so now I actually went out before I show you all this next clip I actually went out to every Walmart in my town it was like five five Walmarts 
I went to every Walmart to find some more R's to give because I only had three. Everybody was out of R's. And then I had a friend, they called me up. They said, hey, yo, go to Michael's right now. They got a new shipment of R's. Keep that thing going. So I go to Michael's to go get some more R's. Well, this is what happened. Oh, you know what? Hey, uh, sir, I, do you all happen to have any more R's? Um, we give out R's. <laughs> Please. Yeah, so we're, we're all out of R's. You want uh, uh, MGK to have all our R's? But I, what? You know what? I do have, I do have B's. A B? Yeah. <sighs> um, let me see. Uh, actually, how many do you have of these in stock? You know, I have about like 40 of them in stock right now. You know what? I'll take them all. We giving out bees. We got to give out bees now here in when it's 2021. We give it out bees. Now bees can stand for I don't know. <laughs> I know the first thing y'all thinking when y'all hear B. We give it out B. B stand for come on people, we gotta get creative. Man, that means I got to do the whole song all over again. Man, maybe one of you all, if you guys got some musical talent, if you want to record a gotta get this beat, <laughs> if you want to record it, then maybe every time I play a segment, this segment, um, I'll be playing your song pre-promotion. But anyway, we need to get back because this guy, Zeno, of a Zeno, he had a lot more to say. Okay, so here in this next part is where Okay, so here in this next part, and I'm just waking up, but here in this next part, Bazino, he starts to talk about how um, Eminem fans, if you guys see him in person, he's gonna beat you all up and that you guys can only type on the computer. And then he said the same thing with Eminem, that he had no right to go at Snoop. And then um, he said that Snoop, when he sees him, is gonna punch him in the face. Let's hear what he has to say. <laughs> they get mad when I talk about that motherfucking cracker. They, boy, they get mad. It'd be a bunch of them. I wouldn't give a fuck. They all pussy. They ain't doing nothing to nobody. All they gonna do is this. Oh, shit. You could be looking like a shady You <laughs> about to go off when you see these two Watch it, watch it, watch it. <laughs> oh man. It's a damn shame, man. We're not even, we're just gonna block you out of here. See you later, buddy. You know the problem with Slim Shady fans? They want to make you like this motherfucker. They get mad like Snoop said he, he ain't in the top ten. And this cracker went and made a song talking shit about Snoop, knowing that if he sees Snoop, Snoop's going to punch the shit out of his face. Like, that's what kill me about these motherfuckers. They talk so tough, but as soon as they get involved with some tough shit, it's like, hey, man, hey, bro. Come on, bro. Why does it have to resort to violence, bro? Fuck, man, we was born in the violence. That's all we know. You stupid motherfuckers. This is the culture. You get your shit twisted. All that little funny, goofy shit y'all be, that don't mean nothing. Y'all niggas was raised in a whole different life. Y'all niggas turn red when y'all get scared. Like anxiety, get patches and shit. Man, get the fuck out of here, man. Got him, coach. Got him, got him, got was it? That's so sad. <laughs> this is sad at this point. That's our next R. So then the Zeno he goes back once he get done this two hour Instagram live stream on Eminem. Two hours. He then goes to Twitter. And he ends off with some a little motivation, actually. It was a little motivation talking about America. And he does um, talk about how um, all white people are not bad anymore. He said all white people aren't bad. I guess they all white people used to be bad. But in this tweet, he said not anymore. And then he brings up an Eminem song that I have never heard. He bring up an Eminem song where um, he said that uh, you guys don't remember when Eminem made that song where he said that all black people, you know, are bees. 
and then he talks about our women. I never heard that song, but maybe you all heard it. But uh, this is his tweet. Let me read it off. One about America is no matter how we murdered, put in slavery, tortured and ripped, jailed and still obviously to this day abused, you will always have those house niggas worshiping their every move. It's sad as, but guess what? I'm not one of them. Now, yes, not all white people are bad anymore, hence the word on in, anymore, but history is history and it's still going on today. Racism is this and when an artist like Eminem makes a song saying all black people are bees and gold diggers saying white women are better, it's not forgiven. No anybody who thinks differently. I don't give a what y'all goofy stands think. Gotta get this, gotta get this off. You know you wrong. Gotta get this off. Gotta get this off. You know you wrong. <laughs> I'm gonna miss the R's. So guys, for all of this, we are going to give Bazzino the R. And for the, um, if you are new to the channel, be sure to subscribe. It's super fun here. Um, send me on Instagram or Twitter if you want to make that track for a beat. But other than that, I guess this is our last time um, for this track. Gotta get this R. Play that sweet, sweet jam. <laughs> you know what Evolvers, they ain't gonna like this one. No. DJ Buffy in the building. Gotta get this That's R. right. That's Gotta right. We gonna song. give out this all Gotta today. This we done ran out of Gotta L. So. Get this you know you wrong. Retarded. Ratchet. Yeah. Ridiculous. Racist. R. Kelly. Respect. Regret. Rejection. Reset. Resign. Restrict. Revolt. R.I.P. Rough. Rotten. Rude. Ruin. Rap. Gotta get this off. Gotta get this off. Gotta get this off. Cause you know you wrong. You gotta get this off. Let's get it. You gotta get this off. You gotta get this off. Cause you know you wrong. <laughs> That's right. Y'all ain't gonna like this one. They took all the L's last year, so all we're giving out is all's right now. We're gonna take this one.